Good morning. Monday morning heading now to Natanya to a conference for the Retail Innovation Club, the annual conference. The CEO is a good, good friend of mine, Oren Paran, who's been on the vlog many times. I'll be uh, moderating a session and emceeing part of the event. It's going to be a great day. And then heading to Tel Aviv to meet Barak from Seatree. Just catching up, syncing up. It's going to be a pretty geeky and fun day. Here we go. Tanya, look how beautiful it is here. Right on the beach. I think it was the last parking spot in this parking lot. And the venue, the hotel, is right there. I haven't been to Natanya in many, many, many years. But it turns out there's some incredible companies in this city, like Spark Beyond, to name one. And Kira Radinsky is here also. Some incredible people. All right, now to find the actual event. <music> the hour, the big boss. Who are you? What's your name? My name is Oren Paran. They should know that by now. The wa yes, Whoever yes, watches yes. this should know your name, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Tell, where are we today? We are here in Netanya in the West Lagoon Hotel. But, by the way, beautiful hotel. I've never been here before. Wonderful. It's amazing. We have uh, the old Mediterranean. Be, 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 under us. Unbelievable. Amazing place. Okay, so how many people coming today? We hear about uh, 450 people, all the retail industry, a lot of startups, amazing startups, and uh, businesses and angels in the street. What are some big retail names that are going to come today? Oh, so first of all, we have international guests from American Eagle, Urban Outfitters, from Decathlon, and we have all the Israeli retail industry. And, and Deloitte. And Deloitte, of course, we have Deloitte, we have Shibolet, we are one of awesome. the major uh, lawyers uh, in Israel. 450 people today? Yeah, Love it's, it. it's a close event. Listen, so I would I would stay here and talk to you for longer, but I, I noticed over that someone's eating shakshuka. <laughs> yeah. So I gotta do the shakshuka. You should run over, uh, yeah. uh, We have good food today? It's the most important thing. Great food. Have a good day. Anything I can do to help, let me know, all right, man? Thank you. Thank I'm looking you. forward. And Thanks, thank dude. Thank you all for your help. Of course, man, anytime. supermarket has shelves. These guys are changing shelves. Tell me about this. So our shelf, uh, through the use of sensors, identifies uh, products that are on the shelf or not on the shelf and sends real-time information to management and supply chain to be able to give you information about out-of-stock, in-stock items. So you got Huggies and pasta and you got all this stuff and this shows up on the screen right here. So if we pull this off and wait about seven or eight seconds, yeah. you'll see that it's recorded that we took Ceylon off the shelf. Where do I see that? Oh, it turned red. Turn That's red. awesome. Yes. That's awesome. And that'll send information based on thresholds to the management of the company. Super awesome. So you can talk about inventory and leftovers and all inventory, that jazz. Inventory. Love it. Whether Very you need cool. to order or not. Sweet. So I'm doing a panel at like, what time? 10.45? 11? What time? 11.10. 11, 10, 11, 10. So two panelists. You? What's your name? My name is Omer ben -Tri. And what do you do? I'm a partner in uh, Shibolet Law Firm in Tel Aviv. One of the biggest law firms in the country? Yeah, one of the biggest four. Love it. And yeah. joining us on the panel is, do you remember her name? I think it's uh, Ellison, a Ellison. partner from uh, Deloitte, like US. A senior partner from Deloitte. Yeah, right. So I have to sit with her before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Corporate America, you know how it is. Yeah. Anyway, I'm looking forward to the conversation, man. Great to meet you. Likewise. Let's have a cup of coffee soon. Yeah. Okay, thanks. Thanks. It's always fascinating when I bump into someone who I've been connected with for a long time and I've never met. What's your name? I'm Yoni. Yoni Nabu. How many times have we been we supposed to have a cup of coffee? Yeah, at, least, at least twice. <laughs> like, if we keep doing it. What's your story, real quick? So I, uh, I founded this Imagine, one of the pioneers of augmented reality, and sold it to Snapchat about two years ago. The only Israeli acquisition, right? The only Israeli acquisition, yes. Love it, man. Mm -hmm. You got me some, some snaps. What are you doing now? So working on some cool new stuff, mostly in Israel. Dude, let's have a cup of coffee already, man. Show me, show me a message. We're gonna do We'll do it. Awesome, man. Thanks. See you Good soon. To see you. Good to meet you, finally. So what do you mean? Not every tech conference has a view like this? What is this? This is a solution for e-commerce photography. Perfect lighting conditions, automatic background removal, efficient workflow. What does it do? It does photography, 360 photography. 
name? Rob Cohen from Vizio. Love it, man. Great to meet you, my friend. Good to meet you. Super cool. Nice surprise this morning sitting here. Well, I'm not, I guess it shouldn't be. I don't know why I was surprised, but it was a very nice surprise to see you. Sitting here in this retail innovation club annual event, and one of my favorite people walks in. So, Lee is the founder, co founder of a company called Sight, S Y T E, that is basically changing the way. And I, by the way, literally, I'm getting on stage in a half an hour, and one of the questions, out of like the four questions that I'm asking, is about visual search. Hmm. Literally, I'm not even kidding. Yeah. All right, but, but why am I talking so much? Tell me about mm -hmm. you. What's your name? What's your story? Talk to me. So my name is Lihi, and as you said, I'm one of the co-founders of Sight. And you know, it's interesting. You, you're going to go up, you know, on stage and talk about visual search, one of the top questions. And I remember when we started talking about it uh, four years ago. We're like, what's visual search? <laughs> People would look at me, you know, like a little puppy, like, what? <laughs> and today it became norm, it became standard, it became what Default. millennials and Gen Z are actually looking for. Right. They want an experience and they want to be able to search and find and discover right. the product. That the products that inspire them right. all visually. They don't want to you know, go through the trouble of explaining what they're looking for. Wait, so let me, let me try to dumb this down, mm. okay? Yeah. For those that might not know what visual search is. Mm -hmm. Right now, in many instances, in many kind of areas of our life, mm -hmm. there are, we behave like it's 1990. Mm -hmm. We haven't evolved, right? Mm -hmm. And there are many, many companies out there trying to solve this problem. Here's the guy I saw before yeah. from your team. He's taking oh. a picture of us right now. Uh, very meta. You know, and so there are many, many things that we do and behave like it's 19. I just sat, my last vlog episode that I posted this morning was mm -hmm. with a company that's, that looked, it looked at car dealerships. Mm -hmm. like car dealerships sell cars. It's, you know, we call them used car salesmen for a reason, mm -hmm. right? They behave like it's 1990, right? It's ridiculous. And there are many other instances. Search is one of them. Mm -hmm. like, first First of all, let's just start with the fact that why am I even searching in the first place? Like, yeah. why is it not searching for me? Mm -hmm. Why is it not finding Absolutely, me? Yeah. This phone knows where mm -hmm. I am, what I like, what I want to do, and right. Why is it not finding me? And that's, mm -hmm. by the way, just so you know, why Adam Singolda started Tabula. He's like, he was he was surfing channels in his mother's living room. He's like, why do I have to search? Why isn't it? It knows me. Why isn't it recommending content? Mm -hmm. And that's why we started Tabula. But now, I'm, I'm all over the place this morning. I had a lot of coffee. But <laughs> forget for one second search finding me. If I'm going to search, uh -huh. like I should use this thing to search. I should be able to take a picture of something and. The search engines find what I'm looking at, mm -hmm. right? Based on visual, we're visual creatures. Like literally opening up a phone and typing in. Okay. It's like what the? Yeah. Like we don't behave that way. Mm -hmm. Except when it comes to search, we still do. Enter sight. And you know, you and me are not a good example because we're not even millennials. That's true. But millennials and Gen Zs, you know, they expect it. Right. So in December last year, Sight became the official power technology of Samsung Bixby in wow. Europe. Wow, wow, wow. So we're live on Samsung devices in. Germany and UK wow. and I knew you before you were hotshot. <laughs> That's unbelievable. That's yeah. super cool. Tell yeah. me about the company a little bit. How many people yeah. are in the company now? So we are uh, just about 50 people in Israel, and we ha also have an office in London and in New York and in uh, Geneva. Unbelievable. Uh, by the end of the year, or a year from today, it should be. You know, it will be double. Uh, and because things are happening very fast, we're experiencing hyper growth. Love it. Love it. Uh, and it all started. Founded site four years ago, but we were in development mode, stealth right. mode for three years so Amazing. it's all happening very quickly how much capital did you raise all together um, very small amount 10 million and it's very, what you've done that is a very small amount. I mean objectively yeah. it's a lot of money but mm -hmm. but compared to what you've yeah, done it's yeah. incredible. and some of your investors are like bonkers like yeah. unbelievable stuff mm -hmm. yeah. listen it's it's unbelievable mm -hmm. to watch don't forget the little people uh, we'll have a cup of coffee soon but uh, keep doing what you're doing I'm, I'm watching as a fan from the side thank you shout out to your husband of course uh, what's wrong with sure. you give a shout out to your husband you're being naughty her okay. co-founder by the way I just wrote a post recently about yeah. power couples they were in the post because Power, there are a lot of power couples in Israel. There's a lot of them. There are, yeah. So, what's it's your role? That it works. He's the CEO, you're the CO, CMO? Um, yeah, I look after sales and marketing together. I do look at it as a as one funnel, but that's a different topic. Different topic for another time. Yeah. Love it. Site AI. Site.ai is the website, correct? S Y T E. Yeah. Joseph, put the link right there. Check them out. Are you guys, it's, it's full B2B, right? There's no B2C component, right? Full B2B SaaS machine. Right. Love it. But you were, you were back in the day, I don't know if you want to talk about this, you might have to edit this part out, but you mm -hmm. were powering the whole. Kim Kardashian thing. Yeah, and but so, that's like different lifetime. Right. That's, that's, we that's are, last time we cut. Well, that just shows you how long we haven't had a cup of coffee. Our core DNA is SaaS B2B. Love it. All right, Enterprise. Keep, keep doing what you're doing, and we'll have a cup of coffee soon. Cool? Good Thanks. Call. All right, I've been told to come to the stage to mic up. I'm not sure where that happens, but oh, here, okay, here we are, backstage, getting mic'd up here. Hello. What up, what up, what up? Hello. Let's do this thing, man. Yeah. Mic it up. I, I 
I would posit a couple of pieces of, of advice for the startups that are here today. And we are, and we, are plan, we are planning to talk to you, but let me tell you, I work with major retailers in the US and around the world. The first thing you have to do is forget how cool your system is and put a business case together that says, this is the user case that I have. This is what it will do for the customer and for you, Mr. Retailer. This is, the, this is what you're gonna either improve your efficiencies or you're gonna improve your margins or whatever it is. But you have to be really, really precise because there's a lot of noise in the ecosystem. And if you can't help the retailer with that actual challenge, it will be hard to cut through all that noise. I think that's a global principle. Instead of focusing on what you're building, focusing on focus on the value for me, for your recipient of your technology. Very important. Just finished our uh, our nice panel with this dashingly handsome guy. How was the panel, man? With the handsome uh, oh, uh, interviewer, it, it was good, was right? Fun. Yeah, it was yeah. Good conversation. Yeah. We had you, was one of the one of the biggest law firms in the country, and then we had a senior exec from Deloitte U.S. Right. So it was two sides of the equation. What's your name? My name is Omer Benzvi. Omer Benzvi. And what's your role? What do you do? I'm a partner in Shibolet. Law firm. What are you, the top, top four, top third? Top four. Top four, top four yeah. law firms in this country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're, you can't talk about specific clients, but is it fair to say that you are working with the world's largest companies? Yeah. In China? It is. In China? It is. In, in their operations in Israel. I have Investments, M&A, R&D centers, etc. I love it. I have one request. Next time you need someone to come to China with you, invite me. I'll take you. I love no Shanghai. Problem. I love Shanghai. One of my favorite places on earth. Well, Outside of Jerusalem, Shanghai. Go and pack your stuff because I'm going in the next day. Uh, one or two weeks. You have room in your suitcase? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Not for me. It was great to meet you, man. Looking Thank forward you. to a cup of coffee soon. Thank you. I've gotten my fair share of interesting swag over the years. There have been bags. There have been shoes. I'm wearing some Envision socks. Can you see that? Some, some cool swag. But this is a first. Who are you? What's your name? I'm Ellie Jacobson. Ellie Jacobson. Fashion uh, wearables, fashion tech designer most of the time. What are you giving me? I'm Tel Aviv flip-flops. Tel Aviv walk on map flip-flops. Si. Take a zoom shot. You have everything here. Uh, Rothschild, Bauhaus, Abima, Dina Square, uh, Dizengoff Center. Everything we have here, the map, the road, Dude. the icons. So now there is no reason for any visitor, high-tech groups, convention to walk with any other flip stuff except Tel Aviv. How do people buy this? They buy it. They can buy it online. We have it in stores already from starting. It just arrived last week. Just Google Tel Aviv flip-flops. Tel Aviv, uh, walk on map flip-flops and you'll find me on Instagram, Facebook. What's your Instagram? Uh, walk on map. Walk on map. Walk on map. Walk on walk. map. Walk on map. You walk on the map. Got it. Right? That is super duper. Walk on map, Tel Aviv. Oh my God, that is amazing. Thank you, dude. Thank you. <laughs> Made it home. It was a pretty fantastic day. A lot going on in the retail tech space in Israel. Tomorrow, bright and early, in the David Citadel in Jerusalem for a prop tech event, property tech, real estate. And then, by the way, Wednesday, an ed tech event. So that's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, conferences. It's going to be pretty nuts. See you tomorrow.